Well, delighted to say that we've been joined by uh, Josh Walker, who's signed on loan until the end of the season from Burton Albion. Josh, firstly, welcome. Thank um, you. Just give us your first thoughts on uh, concluding the deal to bring you here. I know, I'm delighted to be here. Heard about uh, the interest a couple of days ago, and it was a no-brainer for me. Of course, I say you're known from, from Burton, but you don't live a million miles away from here, do you? Was was a location a, a key factor in you, you coming here? Yeah, no, that was a big factor as well, obviously. So it's, about, it's about an hour from where I grew up in Hackney, East London, so that was also a big factor, me coming here. Talk me through your early career, coming through at Spurs and, and, and Fulham and then going to into an only. Just, just talk me through your journey until now, really. Oh, I've had a quite interesting journey, to be fair. Um, signed for Tottenham when I was 10. Was there till I was 15, got released. Signed for Fulham, was there till I was 19, got released. Then found it hard because obviously I hadn't played much men's football. I had a uh, loan at Wallstone when I was at Fulham for a month, but that was the only men's football I had. So stepping out of Fulham was kind of hard. So I ended up at Hendon in non-league, done well there for a season, scored some goals. Uh, then got moved to Barnet in the National League, done well there, spent three years there. Then I thought I needed, uh, needed a bit of a change. So I went to Dagenham in the National League done well there, uh, spent 18 months there, scored some goals and then got a move to Burton last deadline day. Uh, since I've been there, it's been a bit frustrating. Didn't go how I wanted it to go, but I'm here now on loan and I'm ready to go and get back doing what I do best, which is score goals. How would you describe yourself as a striker? What can Jill's fans expect to see from you? I would say... Many people compare me to Jermaine Defoe. I'm that type of striker. I like, I like to get off the shoulder, um, finish with both feet, quick, uh, can dribble. So, yeah. It's got a lot of goals, of course, for Barnet and, uh, and and for Dagenham. How excited are you at the prospect of, of potentially making your Jules debut on, on Saturday, assuming all the paperwork goes through on time? Yeah, hopefully everything goes through and I'm able to uh, play my part in that game and hopefully get on and score a goal. I think fortuitously for you, you do actually know someone in the dressing room because I believe you played with uh, Shea Alexander while you were with Barnet. Yeah, yeah, I was with Shea at Barnet for a couple of years. I think he got a move to Wimbledon from Barnet, but now he's a good guy. And yeah. Have you set yourself any personal goals from now until the end of the season, or are you very much a focus on the next game sort of mentality? Um, I'm focused on the on the next game really. Just want to get my head down and hopefully get maybe like five, ten goals uh, to the end of the season and hopefully push into the playoff places and help the club get promoted. Yeah, that's where the club wants to be, isn't it? In, in that in that top seven, and I guess you've come here hoping to achieve that too. Yeah, yeah, no, definitely. I, uh, this club's definitely not a league league two club. Obviously, they spent the time in the Championship and in League One, so hopefully I can help bring them back to where they belong. And you're no stranger to Priestfield, of course, because I think you played here last season in the, in the FA Cup when the pitch was literally freezing over as the game wore on. Yeah, actually, that was actually the replay game because yeah. obviously we played at Dagenham. I scored late on in that game and then we see Gillingham equalised in like the dire moments. But yeah, came back here and... Unfortunately, at that time we lost, but yeah, no, I've played it before and I enjoyed it. It was a good atmosphere when I was here. So now, was it just a case of training tomorrow and, and raring to get going? Yeah, no, definitely going to be here tomorrow morning, ready to go. Lovely, hopefully we're raring to go on Saturday. Let's hope uh, all that paperwork goes through. But Josh, welcome to the football club and we look forward to seeing you play. Thank you, pleasure to be here.